Howdy folks, Synthetic Mason here, and today we're going to break it up with Rodimus, Grimlock, and Cogman, all from last night. That movie I didn't watch, but hey, here they are. For starters, Rodimus, Hot Rod, Rodimus Prime, Steve, I don't know what they call him. Uh, he was like a weird kind of Lambo-y vet thing, sure. Uh, for his transformation, I'm just going to flip him over, turn this piece to be his chest piece. Ta-da! Yeah, complex. Next up, we have Cogman. If you thought Rodimus was difficult, don't worry. Cogman's totally easy. Um, say similar design, but completely different. Are you ready? We're going to start by bringing up that front piece and turn it into the chest, just like Rodimus. But wait, there's a twist. We'll literally twist the front, bring down these front sections here, twist the bottom, and Cogman. And if you want, he's totally a headmaster. And last up, there's Grimlock, which conveniently, if you have my Optimus Prime, they almost combine. And by combine, I mean gravity and resting one on top of the other one. Sure. For a size comparison, not bad. Definitely a big dang dinosaur. Uh, for his transformation, we'll start by removing his weapon. And then we're going to remove the head section all the way back for a second. Pull out and close up the legs. Rotate those around. We'll then bring down the jaw and crush that all against the chest. Bring the arms forward, open up the face, rotate the little head so that the point is going back. That's that new piece for the beekeeper. Bring those down, and then you'll take his weapon, put it in his hand, and gosh darn it, he's not bad. Yeah. So how about that? So I don't know if this was a scene from a movie, but uh, it looks cool. So yeah, this has been a weird one. So Grimlock, uh, Rodimus, and Cogman. Uh, in the next one, We'll do some tutorials. Put all of these guys in. And then I'm done with the Bayverse. All of the Bayverse. And then it's over. No more. I can start doing G1. That's what I want to do. Thanks, guys.